touchdowns, uh, two that were really plus, fourth and 11, and obviously the one for, one for the win. Just kind of running through both of those plays if you win. Well, um, all week, um, I've been talking to Marcus about anytime he, um, you know, anytime we wear it down or whatever and we need a big play, um, just look at me and, you know, I'm going to do what I can to get over it and um, eventually get the ball in my hands and um, make it happen. But uh, on the fourth and 11, it was a, a a post route, and I decided to cut it short because I seen Marcus in trouble, and, and he found me, and uh, you know, I was able to make the play after the catch. And uh, of course, the game went a touchdown. Um, it was something that I dreamed of, you know, as a little kid, and um, it was finally come true. And um, Byron and like all my teammates was aiding me on, uh, you know, keep pushing. Um, they needed me, and I was able to keep it going and just dig deep. Um, I left everything out on the field, and you know, Margaret was able to find me in the end zone um, for the game that touched down. Let's go in the front. Since you talked about the first two, can you talk about what happened on, on the first touchdown? And also, what was Oregon State, what kind of looks was, was their secondary getting that allowed you to exploit it? Honestly, I, I can't even remember the first touchdown. Um, I was just so caught in the moment. And, um, Oregon State, you know, they was giving us a lot of. Um, Tampa two and cover two and um, you know they they're a base defense for quarters but they really they really wasn't in quarters the whole game you know it was two man and you know, Tampa two and cover two so um, we were able to you know get things rolling um, when they try to stack the box and um, you know make plays downfield. Chase, Josh, how would you describe your emotions right now? Uh, I have no idea. Uh, uh, they're happy, I can tell you that. Um, um, surreal. Um, just didn't, you know, didn't imagine my last game would come down like that. And, um, you know, it's everything that I dreamed of, like I said, um, as a little kid growing up um, in a back, backyard playing with my dad and my cousins. Um, you know, we'll always go, we'll always go with those scenarios. And, um, it finally came true. You know, I've been waiting for this moment ever since my senior year in high school. Um, when I had that game on a touchdown. So um, to leave out on the note that I left out on, um, it's pretty amazing. Right here. Josh, quick two questions. Can you describe your route on that one and then your catch? It was a heck of a catch, not an easy catch on uh, the game winner. Okay. Second one is, does this help you guys feel better now uh, after last week? We've always felt better. Um, you know, we just didn't play up to a part last weekend. You know, that's on us as players, you know. Um, we were able to find our edge early on and, um, you know, could have been a lot easier for us as an offense, but we had turnovers and um, that's, unlike, that's unlike us. So, um, but as far as the, the, the game on the touchdown, um, you know, um, Darryl, he ran an excellent route to take the safety out in the corner out and, you know, he was able to clear that route out for me and, you know, I did the same thing for him on the drive. So, um, for him to return a favor and um, allow me to get, make the game on touchdown, um, you know, it it was, you know, everything I asked for. Um, and, you know, um, just seeing the ball coming in and, um, you know, a lot of thoughts running through my mind and, um, you know, my main focus was just to secure the catch and, you know, I was able to do that and um, the crowd went crazy. <laughs> Will? Josh. Uh Evo said that you two had a conversation at halftime. Uh, what did you guys talk about? It's just like, you know, I need to step up, you know. Um, we've been talking about this all year, and um, it was just this game where, you know, Marcus was able to find this group, and we were able to be on the same page all the time. And, um, you know, at halftime, Evo just told me that, you know, it's going to come down to you. And, you know, I took that, took that in, and um, I was able to carry the offense um, on the on the drive that we installed out on it. Um, you know, how they would make plays for the team. Right here. How important was it for the 20 guys who were recognized at the, or before the game to get that win and to have an undefeated long season? Uh, it was very important. You know, we talked about always going out and playing for the man to the left and right of us and, um, you know, to, to go out on top. Um, against the Beavers, our rivals, um, you know, it felt amazing, you know, um, all game, you know, I just thought about those guys to the left and right of me, and especially the seniors, you know, um, I came in with most of those guys, and, you know, I built a connection with most of those guys, so, um, you know, it, it's a great feeling to have.